Oh, this is gonna be rough, y'all. Listen, listen, listen. I'm Mir. I'm Sophie. It, right now, it's still a work in progress. I mean, I'm still used to being like this and <laughs> sitting back and stuff like that, looking at y'all. I don't know how far it looks. I don't know how good it looks. But, you know, we're trying to get things looking as smooth as possible. Yes, because the couch was very uncomfortable. Comfortable. We couldn't do we it. We have to start from somewhere. But now... My we but. got these gaming chairs that he recommended. I mean, yeah. I wanted to go with the office chairs because I wanted it to be a little bit more sleeker. Yeah. Because, you know. But like, I thought it looked cool. Yeah. Blue and red. I guess I just, that's what he wants. So, anyway, despite that, they're comfortable. And I hope y'all are comfortable watching this video. And listen, we're about to watch. Star Wars Revenge of the Sith, man. If y'all yeah. stuck long into this intro, if you're a true fan of Mare and Sophie, you already know what the deal is. Smash that like button, guys, if y'all at this part of the video. And comment and subscribe like y'all usually do. Like we said, the past three videos we had, we're, we're getting this together. But right now, it's going to be a work in progress. So just stay with us. Anyway, don't forget to look in our description for a week early access for full length movie and shows. And let's get right into it. As the Republic falls, Anakin Skywalker becomes the evil Darth Vader. We already knew this. Yeah. You know, it's just now Sophie's <laughs> finally gonna see it all come together. Episode. Episode Three. Three. Revenge of, of the, the Sith. Sith. War! <laughs> the Republic is crumbling under attacks by the ruthless Sith Lord, Count Dooku. There are heroes on both sides. Evil is everywhere. In a stunning move, the fiend fiendish droid leader, General Grievous, has swept into the Republic capital and kidnapped Chancellor Palpatine leader of the Galactic Senate. As the Separatist droid army attempts to flee the besieged capital with their valuable hostage, two Jedi Knights lead a desperate mission to rescue the captive Chancellor. Well, the Chancellor is definitely playing both sides. So... Him hmm. getting captured is yeah. like... Huh. Why would he get captured if he's already playing both sides? Hmm... <laughs> I guess the um the CGI gets better and better each movie. Yeah, I guess it does. And clearly right now is a crazy battle. Because remember Light the last movies. one didn't end off lightly. Right. It, it wasn't sense. a win. Lock on to a Mar two. Oh, his voice. He changed. <laughs> <laughs> he got older. <laughs> can you really fight in that like i feel like you can instantly die to get out of that alive you gotta have the force with you surge all power units are to stand by reverse thrusters no look at that relationship between mm -hmm. him and r2 like that's so crazy <clears throat> like when you first started the movies you wouldn't have thought like darth vader and r2 were like actually yeah friends I mean, you saying that, I didn't know, like, he even built, um, the other one, the other robot. I always forget his name. I don't know why. C-3 for you. Yeah. R-4, be careful. You have a... Oh, dear. Like, mm. that sucks. R-2, hit the bus droid, center eye. <laughs> Yeah, nice Yo, try, R2, buddy. R2 really be coming in clutch. Yeah. Like, it's crazy. Like, even in the other set of the movies. He was coming in clutch. R2, locate the Chancellor. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> Yo, them droids suck, bro. <laughs> He's so much worse. Who is this? Well, what is it? That's not a person. Whatever that thing is, he looks sick. Yeah. <laughs> but I'm like surprised it gave that droid that type of personality. I said drop him. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, they. What's they, the point? 
of saying drop him. Yeah, why? Like, do, you know, why do they do that every time with the joys? They make them sound be so like clueless. Basically. What that? R2, do you copy? R2, activate the elevator number three. He's like, y'all need to shut up. <laughs> right. Stop. Stop. R2, we need to be going up. Hands up, Jedi. <laughs> Hands up, Jedi. <laughs> like, instead of just shooting him. Now, what is R2 gonna do? Uh oh. <laughs> Oh my gosh. I'm not gonna lie. I did not know R2 could do all that. So the R2D2 is the one of the He is the, the one of the he is the hero, okay? He is one of the greatest heroes in Star Wars history. And there goes this chancellor. <laughs> he look like he more empowered than a prisoner. You see him sitting in that yeah. chair? <laughs> like just chilling. <laughs> Last time y'all fought him, hopefully Anakin does it the right way. I know. I mean, I think he's going I think Duke is going to die. Yo, he is messing Obi-Wan up. You have anger, but you don't use them. Why do you got him looking so evil? <laughs> Anakin, man, listen. Cuz, you know why. Oh! Kill him. Kill him now. I mean... And that's kind of like submitting to the... Dark side. Right. That's why I said, like, the Chancellor is trying to get him to go to the dark side. <laughs> Huh, this scene looks very familiar. Chancellor telling him to do something, Anakin doing it reminds yeah. me of the Yeah. He's the he's the Sith Lord. Just saying it looks very familiar. Elevator's not working. Yeah, because y'all getting lit up. Oh my gosh. Oh. What is going to happen? Oh, not... <laughs> Easy. We're in a bit of a situation here. Did I miss something? Hold on. What is that? Uh... Oops. Oh my goodness. Jump. This is crazy. <laughs> my gosh that was <laughs> only in movies that's all i can say <laughs> that's crazy right yo arts will always getting kicked bro but he never get destroyed yeah that was tough General Grievous, you're shorter than I expected. <coughs> well, why the robot actually acting like he old? The right. R2. Crush them. Wow. Yeah. Wow. That escape was so like effortless. <laughs> What the? <laughs> right, cause I'm like, yo, that was crazy. You lose, Yo, what is wrong with him? Open all hatches, extend all flaps and drag fins. Well, he looked like he learned a lot. Wow. That escape. And he's Anakin seems. Like, he's taking way much more control of this movie. Good. That's a good point. I was trying to find something to say, but yeah, that's a good point. Maybe the first one was The Chancellor looking like everything's going wrong. 
the Chancellor, he looked like a, he looked like he's just there, just scared. He's clearly trying to get Anakin to go to the dark side. Like, he even said, like, leave Obi-Wan. So that the fact that all this is even happening, I think is going against what he thought was going to happen. Let's be fair. Today, you were the hero. And you deserve your glorious day with the politicians. All right. Well, you owe me one, and not for saving your skin for the tenth time. Ninth time. That business on Kato Nemoidia doesn't, doesn't count. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I like this, though. <laughs> like... That communication seemed more... But clearly, you're right. Anakin has learned a lot. Yeah. He's gotten way better. General Grievous will run and hide, as he always does. He's a coward. But with Count Dooku dead, he is the leader of the droid army. And I assure you, the Senate will vote to continue the war as long as Grievous... He clearly has his own agenda. <laughs> right. He seems so, like, manipulative. And that's what I'm saying. He's talking about the... He's a coward. That's what I'm saying, how General Grievous just ran away. It was just so, like... Right. Anticlimactic. Like, you have him there, and he's just, like... Right. He just runs. That's what I said. But that's what I said since the first movie, I didn't trust him. Aww. Oh. Guess who that is? I mean, does, <laughs> That's his wife. Uh, whoa. His what? That's his wife. Shh. You're not supposed to say anything. Nobody knows that. I mean, they... They're in secret. Gotta be quiet. People could be hearing. Something wonderful is happening. She's pregnant. Annie. <coughs> I mean, duh. <laughs> <coughs> mm. And with who? <coughs> <sighs> that's one. That's wonderful. Aww. I love romance. <laughs> so, <aww>. so happy. <sighs> he even walked like an old that's man. What, listen, I was, I was. They really got these droids acting like they're human. I suggest you move the separatist leaders to. That's literally. Come on now. I see it. I was saying this. He's literally the chancellor. And that's why his face is covered. Soon I will have a new apprentice. One far younger and more powerful. Yeah, he's the Sith. I already know. Interesting. Who is this? He's the young one. He's the emperor. He's... he's gonna he's gonna be he's the emperor that Anakin killed in the other set of the movie. I already know. And who is this young apprentice that he's Clearly talking about? I can go early and fix up the baby's room. You're so beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, but like, that is just so cute. <laughs> Okay. Yo, um, should we <laughs> should we watch more uh like drama shows like romance shows? Should we do it? I don't think Sophie can handle it, bro. <laughs> what? The heck was that? I mean, I feel like last time we had like a vision or dream like that, it was accurate. Mm. So he's probably not going to be there when she's having a baby. Rejoice for those around you who transform into the Force. Mourn them do not. Miss them do not. Attachment leads to jealousy. Mm. Mm. What must I do, Master Yoda? Train yourself to let go of everything you fear to lose. Mm. Um, yeah, mm, that mm, is, mm. but I mean, I guess that's the part of being a Jedi. You're not supposed to have attachment. That was like one of the first things they said. He has requested your presence. What for? He would not say. He didn't inform the council. That's unusual, isn't it? All of this is unusual. And it's making me feel uneasy. Yeah, Anakin, mm -hmm. this should make you feel uneasy too. I don't know how you don't see it, buddy. <sighs> he, I feel like whatever the gap was be between the last movie and this, it's showing something in Anakin. Me, a master. Already? They need you more than you know. Mm. 
And as oh we know, the council, the, council uh, the council is already being, is already destruction going on within the council. Our allegiance is to the Senate, not to its leader, who has managed to stay in office long after his term has expired. Mm. The Senate demanded that he stay longer. Yes, but use your feelings, Anakin. Something is out of place. It's just, it's like he's just blinded. Yeah, he's, he's just blinded, blinded man. Uh, it's so irritating seeing it happen. Like, I don't think the boy can handle it. I don't trust him. Is he not to destroy the Sith and bring balance to the Force? <laughs> so the prophecy says. Well then, well, we know he kills the Emperor, and that's Palpatine. Yeah. But it's things that has to happen first. Look at Chewbacca. <laughs> that's not Chewbacca. Oh, I thought it was. What if the democracy we thought we were serving no longer exists? And the Republic has become the very evil we've been fighting to destroy. I don't believe that. And you're sounding like a separatist. Everybody's trying to tell yeah. him. Everybody's trying to tell him. He's so blinded and it's so sad. Is it because the Chancellor is really powerful and he feels like being close to him, he's going to get this power that he already initially wants? I can't see <laughs> I'm blind. Okay, okay. Okay. Our clone intelligence units have discovered the location of General Grievous. He's hiding in the Utapal system. Oh, what a coincidence that you know right. that. Right, exactly. I would worry about the collective wisdom of a council who didn't select you for this assignment. You're the best choice, by far. Oh my god, bro, he's buttering him yeah. up so much, like, <laughs> oh my goodness, right. it's so obvious. How can you be so powerful, but yet so ignorant, Anakin? His mind, he's not, what did they say? They said, that's why they said they didn't think he was ready to become a Jedi, because his mind isn't clear. The Sith rely on their passion for their strength. They think inwards only about themselves. And the Jedi don't. It's like, it's like yeah. he knows the rules so why are you even talking to him right now it, it's literally coming off like how can he not see this Darth Plagueis was a dark lord of the Sith so powerful and so wise he could use the force to influence the midi-chlorians to create life Oh my goodness. <laughs> Yo, like, why do you think he's saying all this stuff to you, Anakin? Like, he knows what you're going through, Anakin. Like, Unfortunately, he taught his apprentice everything he knew. Then his apprentice killed him in his sleep. Hmm. It was him! You did it! <laughs> He's talking about himself. He killed his master to get all this power. And he created Anakin. And clearly, Anakin Not wants that time. power because especially when he's figuring out what's going on with his wife, he wants to save her. So that's why he's going to go to the dark side because he couldn't save his mom and he felt so bad that he could not save his mom and that's been haunting him. So the fact that this could happen to Padme, he don't want it to happen again. <laughs> <laughs> You're round of applause in the chat for Sophie, guys. W's in the chat. And you have become a far greater Jedi than I could ever hope to be. But be patient, Anakin. It will not be long before the Council makes you a Jedi Master. Yes. Right, he needs, like, I don't know, maybe Obi-Wan just needs to, you know. Goodbye, old friend. May the Force be with you. Like, I don't know, maybe if Obi-Wan was more by his side through this whole process, he wouldn't have changed. I can't. Don't give up, Padme. This is Anakin's dream. Oh my gosh, why does he keep seeing that? That is crazy. I mean, obviously, Obi-Wan is right there. I'm not the Jedi I should be. 
I want more. And I know I shouldn't. Yo, honestly, at least he being straight right, up I was about, about to it. Say that. But it's like, dang. So you knew and you just still let it overcome you? I won't lose you, Padme. I'm not gonna die in childbirth, Annie. I promise you. No, I promise you. But it makes sense. Cause like he lost his mom. So he's so hyper focused. Like he doesn't want to lose another person that he truly love and care about. Take the fighter back to the ship. Tell Cody I've made contact. Is he freaking additional warriors? He didn't say. Hmm. Mm. Right, because now he, he seemed like he needed help, and now he seems a little sus. <laughs> a little sus. It seems like everybody. Who's that? That looked like that looked like that was Obi Wan. But was it he just taken off? Mm. He said, but he he said he was taken off. I know. So he lied. Cause he don't. He feels suspicious. Hello there. <laughs> Hello there. <laughs> what he said. <laughs> right, just in the middle of everybody. That's why I like, like, really. <laughs> Hello there. <laughs> I mean, that's like literally cheating. Wow. I knew that. I was acting shocked. That's like, <laughs> that's like cheating though, you know? Yeah. Come on, Kenobi. Bro, he going against four lightsabers right now. <laughs> that's crazy. And, and he learned how to fight against him too. Oh, I mean, hey, 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 that's two, that's two, that's two. Yeah, back up. Like he thought he can take Obi Wan. Be for real. You must realize you are doomed. How does that look like an actual like, like a thing, right? Yeah. Like I don't want to say it's a person in there, but like it looked like it's something that's not. A robot? I don't know how to explain it. I don't know. More and more, I get the feeling that I'm being excluded from the council. I know there are things about the Force that they're not telling me. They don't trust you, Anakin. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> I mean, they don't <sighs> trust him, but it's not even for a bad reason, though. You know? Learn to know the dark side of the Force, and you will be able to save your wife from certain death. Like, that's so specific. Right. right. Like, why would he say something like, exactly? What is he going to do, Sophie? <sighs> know the power of the dark side. Power save back. The thing is, I feel like, it's just crazy how Anakin is hearing all this, but it's like the dark side don't even sound good. So still, why would you still want to go that path? Yeah, brother. Yeah. And he lost all his little weapons. Yeah, you're done, buddy. You're done. Why does he have organs? <laughs> I didn't want to say anything. Yeah. It, I was saying that about his face, but I'm like, it seems weird. Because why would there look like a human type flesh under all that? And I just see no organ. <laughs> like, you see the way he actually feel pain? <laughs> wow. Wow. Well, so whatever he was, gonna, he's so gone. Not, so you're not gonna explain to me? Cause a droid wouldn't even take that long to like, die. If what you've told me is true, you will have gained my trust. But for now, remain here. Wait in the council chambers until we return. But like, what, it, we don't know what was the last thing him and the chancellor talked about? So what if this whole time he's still telling them the truth, but it's a setup? Yeah, that would be pretty insane. Not gonna lie, but, but clearly he didn't like that decision. Yeah, I was about to say that. Master I was about to Windu get to that right. The, the way that he still is telling him, like, don't go and all that. Oh. 
Poor Anakin. Yeah, he is very hurt, confused. Like, Master Windu was right, but he just can't accept it. Yeah. And now but, he's literally, as yeah. we said, going out. He's very confused. He just he just wants to try, you know? It's treason, then. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my goodness. No way he just easily took all of them down like that. And what is Anakin gonna come do? Is he... Cause like the last thing that 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 was like vocalizing was him saving Padme. Is he gonna go there to defend the Chancellor? Cause he wanna learn. Why he keep snarling? What is this problem? He's freaking evil. Bro. <laughs> yes. The oppression of the Sith will never return. You have lost. No. 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 Ew. You must die. Yo, there's no way he just sound like that. Right, like... Oh my goodness, no, please. I can't hold it any longer. I, 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 I can't... I, 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 I can't. Yeah, look at his yeah. face, bro. And that's why he looked like that in the other movies. Oh, don't kill me, please. It's not the Jedi way. He must live. Oh my goodness. And I feel like he's only saying that because he, yeah. Please, don't, don't. Oh my. Oh my gosh. Done. Yeah, what have you done? Are you kidding me? Henceforth, you shall be known as Darth Vader. Oh my, oh my gosh, <sighs> bro. <sighs> and it's crazy because you can see that he didn't even want to do it. Even with, even this whole thing with him saying master, like he don't even want this. He's only doing it for Padme. After you have killed all the Jedi in the temple, go to the Mustafar system, wipe out Viceroy Gunray and the other separatist leaders. So is he telling him to kill all these people to prove? Anyway, this is crazy. Yes, he's saying he has to go and kill all the Jedi at the Jedi Temple, kill the Viceroy. If you're at this part of the video, disclaimer, if you are, if you're already watched our videos, if you're new, I have seen the Star Wars things once. Sophie hasn't. But still watching this, y'all, it's still... This it's sad. To me, it's still hard it's like, to watch. Right. Time has come. Execute order 66. Oh my gosh, she already... Yes, because remember, yeah. the Chancellor was in control of I what? Know. The clones, right? Yeah. And now everything is just in turmoil. Oh my gosh, this is so crazy. And Anakin really does become... Oh my gosh. And Yoda's like, oh my goodness, what just happened? Imagine feeling that, like <sighs> everything just crumbling down. He's about to kill all these kids? No. Yeah, they can't, they couldn't show that because that would be, that would be ridiculous. He's about to kill all those kids. What's gonna be his reaction when he gets back? And sees what Anakin did. Yes. <sighs> I know. I heard there was an attack on the Jedi Temple. You can see the smoke from here. I'm fine, I'm fine. I came to see if you and the baby are safe. 
What's happening? The Jedi have tried to overthrow the Republic. That's not true! My gosh, why are you lying? The Separatists have gathered on the Mustafar system. I'm going there to end this war. Wait for me until I return. Things will be different, I promise. Oh my gosh. And like, I'm not going to lie. Why is she falling for it? Like, shouldn't she be smarter? Uh... Like, no, Anakin. Like, the Jedi aren't like, I don't know. I, I can't even say nothing. Received a coded retreat message we have. It requests all Jedi to return to the temple. It says the war is over. Well, then we must go back. If there are any stragglers, they will fall into the trap and be killed. Oh well, they gonna God. go there and find out what happened. Cause there ain't no more of them. Basically. When my new apprentice, Darth Vader, arrives, he will take care of you. <laughs> so he gave... He and said, everything is okay, Bazzoria. But Darth Vader arrives, he will take care of you. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, take care of you. <laughs> Anakin, or as we should say, Darth, Darth Vader. Vader. Oh, oh man. Did you hear the music? <laughs> oh, man. It's just so crazy, bro. Oh, man. <laughs> And see, as he's doing it, he's turning evil. Yeah, saw his eyes. Because something <sighs> about him killing, remember what they said about like the anger? The anger makes you transform to the dark side and it's giving you that rush of power. The war is over. Lord Sidious promised us peace. He only wants <laughs> Wow. <laughs> I mean. <laughs> the Viceroy <laughs> is gone. Yeah, he did not care. Oh, Lord. Yeah, man, that's that is rough. That ridiculous. It's rough. Yeah, she's like, what? Uh, yeah. Yeah, she don't believe him because Anakin told him otherwise. But then she's probably just so confused, too. He wasn't even... Uh, he doesn't want to kill Anakin. He wants to kill... Oh, my gosh. It's just hard. Padme is blinded by love, too. He's crying. Come on, you didn't have to do this. <laughs> oh, oh man. man, I feel so bad. I feel so bad for him, bro. Like seeing him tear up is like, dang. You can't even take it back anymore. If you didn't notice, Pat May is on her way to go go to Anakin and I know Obi Wan Kenobi snuck onto the ship without her knowing. Yeah, no. He said. Turn to the dark side that you killed younglings. Oh my gosh. I am more powerful than the Chancellor. I, I can overthrow him. And together you and I can rule the galaxy. <sighs> she do not want no parts. You're breaking my heart. You're going down a path I can't follow. I can't. I'm gonna start crying. I can't. I can't watch this part. I love you, liar. Oh my God, tears. The tears are real. You brought him here to kill me. No. No way. Come on, Anakin. Don't. It's no way. Come on. You turned her against me. You have done that yourself. He's literally losing everything. Oh my god. This is not good. I will do what I must. You will try. Oh, <laughs> this is so, so. I hate this. <sighs> this is. It's so hard to watch. At last, the Jedi are no more. Not if anything to say about it. 
Dang. <laughs> yeah. Dang. <laughs> Darth Vader will become more powerful than either of us. Now he don't see it how that's gonna be a bad thing later on in the future. He don't. <laughs> <laughs> So much going on. Nah, they, I'm not gonna lie. These fights go crazy. I'm not gonna sit here and cap y'all. <sighs> oh, goodness, bruh. That was crazy. Oh my god. This movie is so good. <laughs> Into exile, I must go. They done stress Yoda out. <laughs> Even though he was warning them from the beginning, but yeah. And they're still fight. This is like crazy. Is like this is ridiculous. This is crazy. This is insane. This is, this is like literally ridiculous. Like <laughs> any other adjectives, I don't know. I have failed you. I should have known the Jedi were plotting to take over. Oh, you idiot! From my point of view, the Jedi are evil. Well, then you are lost. Like, are you being for real, Anakin? Like, be for <sighs> real with yourself right now. I have the high ground. You underestimate my power. <laughs> oh, what the? Oh my gosh. It was said that you would destroy the Sith, not join them. I hate you. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. He's literally being consumed right now. I loved you. Oh my gosh. I'm not gonna lie. This is like so sad. Oh my gosh. I can't believe I'm actually crying right now. Oh, I hate that part. <sighs> That's how I'm feeling right now, Obi-Wan. That's how I'm feeling. It's like, he was, I can't even talk. Well, now you see what happened to him. She's dying. We don't know why. She has lost the will to live. We need to operate quickly if we are to save the babies. Babies? She's carrying twins. Mm. Yeah, twins. And I'm assuming he named them Luke and Leia. Is she dying because he's dying? Yeah, I don't know if they ever actually... I don't remember like her, their actual reasoning. Luke. It's a go. It's just so sad. I know. How they're both being treated Op right now yeah. and operated on. And we're basically seeing everything come into place. Basically. She's dead. And the whole point of him doing this was to save her. And she's dead. You killed her. I... I couldn't. She was alive. I felt it. Yeah, cuz... I don't think he lied to him. He did lie. He didn't technically, like, ultimately kill her. No! Well, okay, let me say this, let me say this. 
him telling him you directly killed her made it worse is what i'm trying to basically say and he did that on purpose that's what i'm trying to say i know to bring the anger out in him she will be loved with us and what of the boy to tatooine do his family send him yep obi-wan my heart have the protocol droids mind wiped what <laughs> Oh no. So they're trying to wipe the droids. That's probably why they can't remember anything. Right. Mm, mm, mm. It's like, I think every time I try to talk, I, I'm just like tearing up. There it is. It's like badly satisfying seeing all the pieces getting put together. Basically. And then she becomes she becomes princess. princess Leia. And look at little Luke. There was a difference between how Luke and Anakin reacted to death of loved ones. True. True. Like their storyline is is crazy, but it's like the whole point was to get rid of the Emperor. But I feel like Anakin's story is just so sad, like. <sighs> so, Sophie. I mean, listen. If you don't want to go run dev to it because it's going to make you upset, you don't have to. But I'm going to go first then. I, definitely after we watching it, it was really hard. Because you watched a man, you watched a, a a boy, a little kid, and I like how Sophie explained it. The way he grew up is so different from Luke, and the way his mindset was, it kind of from the beginning, even when he was a young innocent kid, it was like it wasn't showing. Uh, it was showing innocence, but in a weird way, like oh, but he was still really smart. And he's uh, he was well aware of a lot of things, right? Like so being then, a slave, all that stuff. Yeah. So then, once basically, um, what Sophie said, the way he dealt with it, once basically he felt lost and pain. It was over at that point. The way he handled it, I think, from a young age, even when he was a kid, when he first was leaving away from his mom, he was just so sad. You know, and honestly, it's like I, I would have took the it's advice like, Yoda said, and I wouldn't have trained him. Yeah. He was like, he's too old. He's too old now. He's not going to, it's not going to be It normal. wasn't even just that. It was all, like, it was that, but also they were saying they were sensing stuff in him. And you got to think about it. Like, and we, and I still don't know everything about Anakin, but like the simple fact, like he doesn't have a dad. He was poor, basically. He was living with his mom. They were both slaves. And then it's like, at that age, for him to be stripped away from his mom and then, like, never be able to go back, it's like, I just feel like everything was a spiral effect. And I'm not going to lie. It's, like, really hard for me to talk because I feel like I'm going to tear up because it's just so sad. It is. Guys, I mean, listen. It explains itself. I think it's because of how it just ends so set so perfectly and it clues back to everything. I right now I'm I don't really have a lot to to uh to, so ar emotional. to articulate you know, to like put together or or I don't know what I'm trying to say. But I mean I feel like I, I, I was explaining everything how I felt. It's just like I don't cry that much when I watch them. When I do, yeah, it just it's hurts. just really hard, and it's it's hard for me to explain. And it's like right. all that emotion Be between him and um Obi Wan. It was just that's so what hard. That's what, like especially once, when he said, "I hate you." Like I'm literally tearing up. That's right what now. I'm saying, bro. Thank it's you. just so bad. It's just so bad. Like basically, once something crazy happens in a movie, it's like I can't or a talk. show is like after the fact. The after talk is like there is no need. In my opinion, like y'all saw what happened, it was ridiculous. It hurts, it hurts. And guys, that was Revenge of the Sith. 
Star Wars like episode the movie, three. I can talk about how like when you put the whole movie together, it was just written really beautifully and you know, seeing someone just go down a path like that, it's just really sad, you know. And just like all the elements they added, like at the end of the day, like the movie started with him being this super passionate kid, but not really realizing like the meaning of every decision he's going to make. And I feel like it is really hard in general to go down this path where it's like, well, you have to do this. Like becoming a Jedi, they were saying, well, he's not allowed to love. He's not allowed to do this. And he was even explaining all that to, to Padme. He's saying like, well, what roots a Jedi to do what they do? They have to care and all that. And I feel like yeah, he, for yeah. him, he didn't have that strong sense in him because he wasn't really aware of that. Like he had this idea he wanted from, to be a Jedi, but from when he was a kid, yeah. it's like he had his he already made his mind up, kind of. And I feel like like semi made his mind. Up. His mom was definitely. A root a factor, big part of his like life. a very big part of his life, and him leaving the way he did, and then go and and that's all. Like in the second movie, it was really showing how like, dang, like I left my mom and I'm doing this thing and I'm not really getting what I want, and then to go back realizing like I'm confused, like why am I even doing this? You know, like that's really hard, and I feel like it was the guidance. He needed more guidance. He needed like. He needed, like, someone to, like, come for him. And I don't feel like he was getting that because of everything that was being placed on him. The only thing that was comforting was who? Padme. The most, exactly. And that's why out of everything, he wanted to protect her the most. Yeah, especially after his mom died. And it's like, in this movie, it's like, I get it. Because everybody like, was telling him what to do. Even though it was for good, it was like... It wasn't what he tr it wasn't what he wanted, and I feel like he wanted comforting. And him being a Jedi to him wasn't comforting. Like, oh, do this. I'm telling you, it's right. And him feeling he's ready, and like he wants comfort. He wasn't getting that. Both of those right, things, and it's so. yeah, it was right, and it's like the way they were also saying like he's not ready to do this, this, and that. And it's kind of like he wasn't really in control of his life. And the one thing that he wanted to do was to save his mom. He couldn't do that. Exactly. So that's why it's like. You know, in movies and shows, like, love will always be an element. At the end of the day, like, that's why even when you think about, like, antagonists in movies and shows and, oh, like, they're a bad guy. Like, nobody's just purely evil unless you're, like, a psychopath. But I'm not going to get into that. It's just the fact that right. to really see the way how he was, um, how his self was degrading throughout the movies it was just like really sad and then to also see like we know like obi-wan really did care about him he you really know? did like obi-wan really, really cared about him and it was just so hard for me to see him say i hate you like oh so bad and he was yelling and everything uh really really sad but you know it's nice to see that you know in the other three films with luke how he was able... You can see, like, Darth Vader, he was still dealing with all the anger. He was still acting in a certain way. But I think it was for him to bring balance and he killed the Emperor. And it's and it's just really sad because, like, he went through all that to do the one thing he probably would have never even wanted to do. Like, I don't think he's just this cold-hearted killer. It's just the things that happened in his life led him to, like, do things like that, you know? So... Definitely well written. I mean, it's really sad. Like, I don't... You know when you watch a movie, you feel like you just connect with the character. Like, that's just how I feel, so... Oh, boy. And seeing also how Padme was, like, breaking down. Like, it's just sad. Once Obi-Wan showed up, I basically knew it was going to happen. That was the if. That was, in, that was the end for me. I completely just... It's just like, yeah, this is bad. It was a good movie, though, overall. Great movie, guys. Yeah, great movie. Great movie. Amazing movie at that. Um, amazing trilogy. 
Yes. Um, I know some people... I know people had their opinions, but I, I, I like... So far, all the Star Wars movies I watched, loved all of them. This one was just very emotional. Like, very emotional. So... But I feel like the essence of the storyline, it was just... I'm going to have to rewatch this again. And, yeah. So now, we're going to move on to the next Star Wars movie. But until before we do that, we hope you enjoyed this reaction to Star Wars Revenge of the Sith. Um, and we will see y'all. On the next one. Perfect.